how many bathroom towels do we need? I was visiting with a friend this week and we were talking about minimalism. She said, oh, I'm interested in minimalism. I, I need to find out some more information. And I was like, well, what do you want to know? Because I could tell you. And she said, for example, how many towels do I need? And I know she's not the only one asking because I remember having the same question. So that's what I'm going to talk to you about today. So first off, remember that minimalism is a tool. It's not supposed to constrain you. It's supposed to help you. And everybody has a different lifestyle. We have different people living with us. Different people have different habits. Different climates require different things. If you're in a very humid climate, you can't use a towel for as long because it doesn't dry out in between and it needs to be washed and dried or they start to smell and get funky. And some of us have regular visitors. So you have to consider all of that when you make your decision. But I'll tell you what we have. We live in a very dry climate. We're in Montana, so things dry quickly. We have five people in the house, so everyone has their own color towel. And then I have four extra bath towels. I found that having four extra is the sweet spot for us. If someone gets their hair cut and they use the towel afterwards, we of course don't want to dry with that towel again. I have two hand towels, 10 washcloths, and one bath mat. So I found this works really well for our family. I wash the towels once a week. Now, if there's a towel dirty that needs to be washed, it normally gets thrown in with the rest of our clothes, but on Saturdays, I make it a point to go into the bathroom, grab all of the towels, grab the bath mat, and wash all of those at the same time, which saves on folding because then I can just hang the towels right back up and I know they're clean. I don't have to fold them at all. I have two hand towels so I can switch one out immediately. I don't have to wait for it to wash and dry and then put it back. And the washcloths, I tend to just grab whenever they're dirty and throw them in the washing machine so they get washed at random. So I found this to be a sweet spot for us. So we have our five regular colored towels, color designated towels. Each person has their own color and those are the ones we use regularly. The other four come into play if someone gets a haircut, if we give the dogs a bath, if I'm making yogurt and I need to wrap up the jars while they're sitting in the oven. All these different things that we happen to use our towels for, I found that four extras covers it sufficiently. So what are the guidelines that we use to determine what our needs are? The main goal in minimalism is to make our lives easier. Ease of use. If you have too many towels, then it's a challenge to get them all folded and fitting properly in the linen closet or digging through and finding the exact one that you want. And if we have too many, we can be tempted to not do laundry as frequently, meaning that the laundry piles up and then we have this daunting task ahead of us. On the other hand, if we only have exactly what we need, if we only had five towels, then we wouldn't have an extra one if we happened to get a haircut and didn't have time to do the laundry but needed another shower. So if we have too little, we would have to be overly vigilant on our laundry routine. It's always finding that balance between too much, too little, easy to use, difficult. That's what we're trying to find. I have approached minimalism like one big life experiment. For me, it has been peeling back the layers, one layer at a time, getting rid of more and more and more until I get to the point where I'm like, yep, this is great. I'm comfortable. This is easy for me. For other people, they might just stick with the bare necessities, stick all the extras aside for a month and just use it to see how life is and if they ever feel the need to go get that extra towel. So think about your habits. How many towels do you use on a daily basis, weekly basis? What are your laundry habits? Do you need to wash your towels every other day? Do you wash your towels once a week? Can they air out and dry or do they need more attention than that? And realistically, how many visitors do you have? Not the idea of like, oh, but I could, but how many visitors do you actually have coming and spending the night that need a towel to use? And how often does that happen? Once you consider all of that, then you can make a decision on how many you need for your life and for your household. While we're on the subject of towels, somebody's going to ask about beach towels. So I do have a stack of beach towels. We ha again have one per person. We do not have any extra beach towels. We just have the five. I keep them all in a bag with our summer stuff. So in the summer, we usually go to the lake. We can grab our floaties, our life jackets, and our beach towels 
and go. When we come home, I wash the beach towels, dry them, fold them up, put them back in the bag, and then put them back with the summer stuff so it's ready next time we want to go on an outing. So that's it. Again, I just strive to make my life easier. What is going to make my life easier? Is it easier to have two per person or is it easier to have the bare minimum? Maybe it's just easier to have like two extra towels total. There's no right or wrong answer. There's no perfect way to do minimalism. It's going to look different in every household because of all the different things we have going on. And if you're worried about getting rid of too much and being uncomfortable without it, then try an experiment. Put those extras aside, keep them in an out of the way place, set a reminder on your phone so when a month comes up, you can reevaluate and decide what makes the most sense for your household. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Mm -hmm.